Series 4, Plant and Animal Kingdom. On this series, we shall be focusing on the characteristics of group of organisms belonging to the plant and animal kingdom respectively. Topic covered, Kingdom Plantae, Classification, Examples and Characteristics. Kingdom Animalia, Classification, Examples and Characteristics. Kingdom Plantae The plant kingdom is divided into five groups. These are, 1. Schizophyta, e.g. blue-green algae and bacteria. Commonly known as cyanophyta. 2. Thalophyta, e.g. the algae. 3. Bryophyta, e.g. the liverworts and the mosses. 4. Pteridophyta, e.g. the ferns. 5. Spermatophyta, the seed-bearing plants, this group consists of the gymnosperm, having naked seeds, and the angiosperms, having enclosed seeds and produce flowers. Now let's take a look at the characteristics of each group. 1. Schizophyta, e.g. blue-green algae, basic features, characteristic, i, they are microscopic. e, they have no specialized nucleus. e, the cell wall have no cellulose. IV, they reproduce asexually by binary fission. V, they obtain oxygen from the atmosphere for their energy and respiration. 2. Thalophytes, e.g. algae, basic characteristics, features, I, they are simple plants without root, stems and leaves. E, they are mainly aquatic with few living on damp soil and shady areas. Example includes Spirogyra, Sagasum and Anabina. E, they reproduce either by sexual or asexual method. 3. Bryophytes, e.g. mosses and liverwort, basic features, characteristic, I, they have chlorophyll as the only photosynthetic pigment. They have chlorophyll as the only photosynthetic pigment. E, they are non-vascular multicellular organisms. E, they are terrestrial but live in moist areas. I, V, they are spirally arranged on the stem. V, they show distinct alternation of generation in their life cycle. 4. Pteridophytes, e.g. ferns, basic feature, characteristics, i, they have true root, stem and leaves as well as developed vascular bundles. e, they reproduce by means of spores. e, the stems have rhizomes. i, v, they are mainly found in swampy areas. v, they are well developed among non-flowering plants. Examples of pteridophytes include azolla, salvinia oblongata, dryoteris, phymatodes etc. 5. Spermatophyta. Spermatophyta is divided into gymnosperms and angiosperms. Gymnosperm basic features, characteristics, i, they are large plants with well-developed vascular bundles. e, they have cones containing naked seeds. e, they dwell in terrestrial habitat, examples gymnosperms include cycas and pine. Angiosperms basic features, characteristic, i, they possess true flowers for reproduction. E, they have well-developed vascular bundles. E, they have well-developed true root, stem and leaves. I, V, seeds and fruits are produced after fertilization. Examples of angiosperms include maize, mango, orange etc. Kingdom Animalia The animal kingdom is divided into two sub-kingdoms namely, vertebrates and invertebrates. Invertebrates, these are animals without backbone. These are grouped into the phyla, periphera, annelida, mosslusca, coelenterata, plali helm in thes, nematodes, enchinodermata and anthropoda. Subkingdom protozoa, common examples of organisms belonging to this group are amoeba, paramecium, plasmodium, volvox etc. Basic characteristic, features of protozoans, i, they are unicellular organisms. e, they are microscopic organisms. That is, they are very tiny. E, they are either free-living, non-parasitic, or parasitic organisms. I, V, they have no cell wall. V, they reproduce primarily by asexual means, although in some groups sexual mode do occur. Phylum periphera, common examples of animals in belonging to this phylum are sponges. Basic characteristic, features of periphera, I, the bodies are radially symmetrical having pores that allow passage of water into the central cavity or sponger coil. Phylum Annelida, common examples of organisms belonging to this phylum are earthworm, leech, polychaete and other marine ringworm. Basic characteristic, features of annelids, i, they are live in marine or freshwater environment as well as moist terrestrial environment. e, they are bilaterally symmetrical. e, they have segmented body in ring form. 
IV, most of them are hermaphrodites, possessing male and female sex organ. V, they reproduce by laying eggs. Phylum coelenterates or cnidarians, hollow sac-like animals, common examples of coelenterates or cnidarians, jellyfish, hydra, sea anemone etc. Basic characteristics, features of coelenterates, i, they are aquatic animals found in the sea. e, they have a hollow sac-like body with only one opening, that is, mouth. e, they have a hollow sac-like body with only one opening, that is, mouth. E. They have mouth surrounded by finger-like projections called tentacles. Tentacles help them in catching food and provision of locomotion in form of swimming. IV. Their bodies are radially symmetrical, that is, the body can be divided into two identical halves along any plane. V. They may reproduce both sexually and asexually by budding. Phylum platyhelminthus, flatworms, tapeworm is a common example of platyhelminthus. Basic characteristics, features of platyhelminthus, i, they have thin and flat body. e, they mostly live as parasites in the bodies of other animals. However, we can also find them in freshwater and a moist environment. e, platyhelminthus can reproduce asexually and sexually by laying eggs in the body of their host. 3.2.3.2 Nematodes, roundworms, common example of roundworm is Ascaris. Basic characteristics, features of nematodes or roundworms, i, they have round and unsegmented body except for a few of them. e, most of them are parasitic in the body of other animals, including humans, for example, Ascaris is a roundworm that lives in the small intestine of humans. Some class of nematodes are free-living. e, they are dioecious, separate sexes. i, v, they are bilaterally symmetrical and are triploblastic. V. They reproduce by laying eggs mostly in the body of their host. Mollusca, soft-bodied shelled animals, common examples of mollusca include snail, octopus, pearl oyster, etc. Basic characteristics, features of mollusca sad face, I. They occur in almost every habitat found on Earth. E. They have soft bodies that typically have a head and a foot region. E. Often their bodies are covered by a hard exoskeleton called mantle. IV, they move with the help of a muscular foot. V, they give birth by laying eggs. Echinodermata, spiny skinned animals, common examples of echinodermata are starfish, sea urchin, etc. Basic characteristics, features of echinodermata, I, echinoderms are marine animals, that is, they live in an ocean or a sea. E, their body is rough, spiny and radially symmetrical, that is, it can be divided into two identical halves along any plane. E, they crawl on the ocean floor with the help of tube feet. I, V, they reproduce by laying eggs. V, sexes are separate except for a few species which are hermaphrodites. Phylum Antropoda, Antropoda is the most diverse phylum in the animal kingdom. Antropoda are eucolomates with well-developed organ system. Basic characteristics, features of arthropoda are as follows, i, they are joint-footed animals. e, in most cases, the body is divided into three parts, head, thorax, middle part, and abdomen, lower part, e, in most cases, the body is divided into three parts, head, thorax, middle part, and abdomen, lower part. e, they have jointed appendages. The phylum Anthropoda is further divided into four subgroups, Crustacea, Myriapoda, Insecta, and Arachnida. Classifications, basic characteristics and examples of Arthropoda, class Crustacea, common examples of Crustacea, Crab, Shrimps, Lobsters, Prawn, Barnacles, Crayfish etc. Basic characteristics, features of Crustacea sad face, I, most of the crustaceans are aquatic, living in either marine or freshwater environments. However, few of them have adapted to life on land. For example, woodlice. E. The body of crustaceans consists of three parts, head, thorax, middle part, and abdomen. But, in most of them, head and thorax are fused as one single part. E. They have many legs jointed to the body. I. V. They possess pairs of short-branched and long-branched antennules. I. V. They possess pairs of short-branched and long-branched antennules. V. They possess maxillae, mandible and maxioles as their mouth part. Class Myriapoda Myriapod means, many foot, which means, countless. 
Common examples of myriapoda include centipede, millipede, etc. Basic characteristics, features of myriapoda, i, these are animals with countless feet. e, myriapoda's body is divided into many segments. Each segment consists of one or two pairs of legs. e, myriapods have a single pair of antennae and, in most cases, iv, myriapods are primarily terrestrial, that is, they live mainly on land. Class Insecta, common examples of insecta include housefly, butterfly, ants, mosquito, grasshopper, aphid, termite etc. Basic Characteristics, Features of Insecta, i, they are the most successful class of the animals on Earth with more than a million species. e, the body of insecta clearly distinguishes between the head, thorax, middle part, and abdomen, lower part. e, the tough exoskeleton, called chitin cover their outer body. IV, they have three pairs of jointed legs. Head bears mouth, a pair of antennae or feelers. V, adult insects typically move about by walking, flying, or sometimes swimming. VI, sexes are separate. They reproduce by laying eggs. Class A R A C H N I D A, common examples of arachnida include spider, scorpion, mite, tick, etc. Basic characteristics, features of arachnida are as follow. I. Arachnids primarily live on land, however, there are some which are aquatic, there are some which are aquatic. E. The body of arachnida consists of three parts, head, thorax, middle part, and abdomen. But, in most of them, head and thorax are fused as one single part. E. They have four pairs of jointed legs and unlike insecta, they don't have antennae. IV. They have no wings but some of them like spiders produce silk which they use to float in the air. V. Many arachnids use silk, either to catch prey or to help them reproduce. V. Sexes are separate, fertilization is internal and they give birth by laying eggs. Vertebrates Vertebrates are animals with a backbone or bony skeleton. Based on their varying characteristics, we further divide them into five classes which are, 1. Pisces, Fishes, 2. Reptilia, 3. Aves, Aves, 4. Amphibia, 5. Mammalia. 1. Pisces, Fishes, common examples of Pisces, almost all fishes and to name a few, Rohu, Shark, Electric Ray Fish, etc. The main features, characteristics of Pisces, or Fishes, are, i, they are aquatic in nature. e, they possess fins for locomotion. e, they possess gills for respiration. i, v, fertilization of egg is external. v, they possess streamlined bodies. 2. Reptilia, common examples include lizard, snakes, crocodile, tortoise, turtle etc. The basic characteristics, features are, i, they have dry scaly skin. e, they are cold-blooded animals. e, they are mostly found on land. Some live in water. i, v, female lay shelled eggs on land. v, they crawl with the aid of a pair of hind limbs and fore limbs. Aves, birds, common examples are sparrow, duck, vulture, hawk, owl, ostrich etc. Basic characteristics, features of aves, i, they are warm-blooded animals. e, they possess wings for for flight and the bodies are covered with feathers. e, they have horny beaks, but have no teeth. i, v, they reproduce sexually by laying eggs with hard shell. v, they have scaly legs and claws on their toes. Amphibians, common examples of amphibians include frog, toad, salamander etc. Basic characteristics, features of amphibians, i, they live a dual life, that is, in land and water. e, they have slimy bodies. e, they breathe through lungs and skin surface. i, v, they possess webbed feet. v, they reproduce sexually by laying eggs. Mammalia, common examples of vertebrates that belong to this group are humans, rat, lion, tiger, dog, monkey, bat, camel, hippopotamus etc. Bat, camel, hippopotamus etc. Basic characteristics, features of mammals, i, they are warm-blooded animals. e, they possess furs in their body. e, they reproduce sexually and give birth to the young ones alive. i, v, their bodies are bilaterally symmetrical. V. They have four chambered heart. V. Most of them possess forelimbs for locomotion. VII. They possess external ears. VIII. Females possess mammary glands. 
Now do the following exercises. 1. Give one example of organism belonging to each of the following group of plants sad face, I, schizophyta, E, bryophyta, E, thalophyta, I, V, pteridophyta. 2. State three features each, of angiosperms and gymnosperms. Point 3. State three basic characteristics of periphera. 4. State three basic characteristics each, of the following, I, nematodes, E, mollusca, E, annelida, I, V, anthropoda, V, echinodermata. 5. A. Mention the five classes of vertebrates. B. State three basic characteristics of each class of vertebrates mentioned. This brings us to the end of the lesson on this series. Please click on like and subscribe to my channel for more of the series. Thanks for viewing.